afternoon, Wallhawks. Today is Thursday, April 14th, A Day, and what are you doing? I'm looking up at the sky. Why? Because today is Look Up at the Sky Day. Think about it. How often do you look up at upwards? Look Up at the Sky Day encourages you to stop for a moment and to appreciate the beautiful blue sky, fluffy clouds, and elegant soaring birds. That's on the assumption that it's not gray, raining, cloudy, foggy, or that you're indoors. Okay, you got me there. Now let's get to our announcements. Students, you do not want to miss out on this year's Warrior Dash. Permission forms are available in the office if you did not receive one on April 8th. Cost, cost is $10 and it includes a t-shirt and a healthy snack after running. Students can ask for <coughs> pledges, sponsorships, from neighbors, family, and friends. All proceeds will support the Renaissance program. Prizes will be determined for the top pledges and top running times, shopping at Dick's Sporting Goods. Sign up in the office or outside of the LRC for sixth graders and South Gym for seventh and eighth graders before school. Students interested in training sessions can obtain a permission slip in the main office. Sessions are from 2.45 to 3.30 on April 13th, April 20th, and April 27th. Students from UWP will provide a workout session and teach you about the form and about form and breathing techniques to prepare you for the Warrior Dash. We will have our final school dance of the year tomorrow, Friday, April 15th, from 6 to 8 p.m. Dance tickets will be on sale at all lunches. Tickets are $5 or $4 with Student Renaissance discount. The theme is decades. De dress in your favorite decades attire. We will have a kickball tournament on the field. It is National Library Appreciation Month. To celebrate, think about creating a bookmark, a poster, or a trailer, or a review of your favorite book, and turn it into the LRC this week for a prize. Some 8-2 students are doing a project regarding modern day slavery and wanted to get the word out about this important issue. They've sent us the following facts. The definition of slavery is the condition of exhausting labor or restricted freedom. There are about 29.8 million people in, the slave, in slavery all around the world. There are about 100,000 slaves in the U.S. alone. There are so many different types of slavery today. Types like human trafficking, forced labor, bonded labor, and child labor. Most in the United States are enslaved in human trafficking. To stay safe, stick with the people you love and trust. Most of the time, people who are forced into this have been taken because they are runaways or are in the unstable state. If you think you might be in a situation like this, now go tell someone. Talk to them and ask them for help on what to do. Thanks to group members like Luke Cannon, Ruby Breastshut, Morgan McDowell, and Samantha Barklow for this valuable information. Here is another, an important reminder for all students. You may not share a locker with anyone else. All students must use their own lockers. Also, the only food allow in, allowed in lockers is food that is in a sealed container. All other food must be consumed in the cafeteria before you leave. Leap activities today are Lego exploration and homework help. Happy birthday to the following Wahawks, Elijah James, Lizzie Johnson, Lily Kemp, Mike Note, and Colin Schweiker. Have an amazing day today. And now for our thought of the day. Look up at the sky. You'll never find rainbows if you're looking down. Look, Look up, up today, today Wash. Wash.